What's up guys, it's Josh from Soul Studios. I just wanna make a quick video to point out one thing that I took away from the wage subscription debacle that we just went through a couple of weeks ago. I know you're thinking, I need one more pro audio channel to make a video about waves. And I get it, it was a, a hot topic. I'm, I'm not knocking anybody for making a video about it, but it seemed like it got a little out of hand there for a while. So I just wanted to sit back, let the dust settle and see if I could maybe offer up something different that wasn't already said. And the main takeaway that I have that I hope you'll implement moving forward as well is that plugins aren't as future proof as we may have thought. One of the appeals of mixing more in the box or completely in the box is that you have future-proof sessions that you can always go back and open and they'll sound the same as the day that you last mixed it, as opposed to hardware, where even if you still have that piece of hardware, it may have aged or sound different down the road. But as we're seeing with Waves and not just them, they are very deserving of all the backlash they're getting right now, but there's others that have gone to subscription or at least towed the line of trying to push us into something we don't want, like Avid has done in the past. So yes, I agree with most of the other takes that we came together as a community, we came together swiftly, we were united, and that's what caused them to change. And we should be very proud of that victory and consider that moving forward when things in our industry get pushed on us that we don't want. But on a practical end, what I want you to do moving forward with all of your sessions when you finish up your mix, is archive in a way that your session will always be future-proof. You can always open it again and have exactly the sound that you had when you completed your mix. Now, for a while, I was freezing certain things, but I've even found that to be problematic because sometimes you need to unfreeze or you're having issues with your session where, as I covered in a previous video about when Pro Tools is crashing, sometimes you need to open with all plugins disabled and then when you have to enable them, maybe you don't have that license anymore or whatever. So. Just bypass freezing, in my opinion, go ahead and fully commit. I'm gonna do some B-roll here to show you exactly what, how that's done in Pro Tools. And I'm sure there's something similar in Logic or Studio One or whatever you're using. So anyway, not to add to all of the waves noise, but I did think this was important to consider moving forward to make sure that you're always gonna be able to open your session down the road. If you need an alternate mix, if you need stems, go ahead and commit all of your sounds, and that way you don't have to worry about Waves or anyone else going subscription only, or a plugin not getting ported over from 32-bit to 64-bit, because now, as you saw in a short I made a week ago, I had to get an old Mac Pro, an old HD Excel system, and I've got to go back and work on some songs that I did 10 to 15 years ago to make stems. And so you really don't want to find yourself in that position because it's Believe me, it's a giant pain in the butt. And if I could go back in time, I would have just committed everything. I wouldn't have put so much trust in the fact that plugins are always gonna be there. My biggest problem is my favorite plugin from that era was the Abbey Road RS124 that got discontinued. So I've gotta go back to a 32-bit system to open these sessions and make stems and alt mixes and things that we need for music licensing. I hope you can learn a little lesson from some of my pain and some of the extra work I'm having to do. So set yourself up for a better future, commit all your plugins, and you'll always have them there for whatever you need. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it's useful for you. If you will like the video, subscribe before you go, and I'll be back again soon. Thanks guys for your time. Take care.